Yeah. Right when you, I heard him, heard him people, and I was like, "What the heck is yeah. it?" First, he was over here, and yeah. then he slowly worked his way over. And I don't know if he must have like winded me or something. Our wind, or... our wind kept spoiling yeah. big time up there. I had a very good wind. That's why I kept on. I closed. That's why I kept on moving in. And right when I moved in, I raked a tree, and then I moved like 20 yards. Dude, I just, I saw him come. I was like, "Oh, shoot, did you see him?" Oh, man. Yeah. Seven at 63 yards according to Chang didn't want to take the shot so they went over here and down in there so I wish I would have been there to catch her on video but I had another job
vertical uphill and bushwhacking gives you one heck of a workout especially when you have a bunch of useless gear in your backpack and a bunch of useless camera stuff like this camera breaking a sweat good thing it's wet on the leaves so I can do this and cool down no joke no joke
guy is the big boy. Yeah, you, you totally irritated me. <laughs> So crazy. We have a big boy way down here. We have two bowls up here and one bowl way up here. <laughs> he hates your view, God. Two at the same time. <laughs> that guy down there. <laughs> He's been. Balls are everywhere. That is sometimes a bull will not come in during the day. But he. But he will at night. Dude, these balls are lights out. It is officially October 1st, which means meal deer season is two weekends away. So for now, I know it's over, everything's over. I have about two weeks before a legit hunting season. So two weekends, I'm able to finally officially hunt something that I'm confident I can shoot. That's meal deer, uh, Idaho, we are done for today. So we, this morning we woke up, we made breakfast, we ate, right now we're just chilling by the campfire and then we're about to head out back to home. Foggy. Foggy morning. It's probably gonna be a foggy day, but just to recap, man, yesterday was lights out. So for my three years of being here, my personal experience, like last night, was one of my best. But anywho, it's October 1st, so let's get out of here. And uh, you know, I hope that when you guys are watching these videos, like you guys learn something from it. Because behind every video, I try to make it either just pure entertaining or informational or something like that so I, behind every video I try to make a purpose for it so I hope that you as viewer can take whatever it is and apply it to your hunting strategies so that's about it and we're gonna go so peace out guys thanks for watching the video